case of chronic congestive failure. 52 years married, three children, businessman, reported 1991. He has a cardiac history for the last 10 years, and he has been in, in and out of hospital several times with progressive ischemic heart disease. He has been on various drugs and lastly on digoxin for the failure. He came to me, to me to find out if homeopathy can help at this juncture. <coughs> uh, I'm the kind who never says no since I'm of the strongest belief and conviction that homeopathy has to help. Of course, the help being limited to the stage of the disease and the nature of disease. But help it will, <coughs> as we see in a very terminal stage of cancer, it helps to die peacefully at least. <laughs> when I took his case, I was not getting anywhere near a clear constitutional remedy. Maybe he was more like sulfur. In my earlier days, I would have given sulfur 200. But I put him on RMRs 200C, three pills, QAD once a week. QAD means four times a day, uh, once a week, for four weeks. <clears throat> At the end, he was clearly less breathless, looked more comfortable, and he also said that his legs were marginally less idiomatous. Repeat four more weeks, he reported to be coughing less in the last weeks, which again is very relevant because with a basal congestion in the lungs, which happens in the uh, CCF, uh, you, you, will, you naturally get a lot of cough and rattling, which when it becomes less is a good sign. And uh, repeated four more weeks, the pedal edema was getting better. The cardiologist was considering to reduce diuretic. I normally try to go for a higher potency after working for about three months. <clears throat> but in this case, the patient kept a steady, satisfactory improvement right through. But for six full months, he was only on RMRs 200C, weekly dose, and nothing else. But certainly, it needs that much of a repetition. It is not a small repetition to be giving once a week for six months. It is a huge repetition, I do agree. And uh, it is a, a departure from the whole conventional style, uh, but this, this works and this is how it works. I've, because I've been experimenting in different, different dosage and different potencies and different methodologies, uh, but all of ours needs a weekly, maybe you can stop after three months and go for something higher, but it needs a, initially, at least for three months, you need a weekly administration. After six months, I moved him to RMRs 1M, three pills QID, once in two weeks, not once a week, but once in two weeks. And this I kept up for the next six months. It was unbelievable that the cardiologist himself took him off almost all the remedies, including the digoxin, which is unheard of. And the patient is doing well in every respect, going for a cardiology review once in three months. Now it is more than 12 years or so, and he is in perfect health. 